though. I'm not going to be able to get a, as good of a session as I wanted to today because I kind of fell asleep um, during the day. And I also spent two hours having a boss battle with a toilet, uh, well, with a toilet seat, which was fun. Um, so just I'm just letting you know that because I actually kind of really bruised up the tips of my thumbs, mainly my right thumb. Uh, and I already know that's going to be a problem. I'm already going to encounter a lot of problems trying to counter anyone today. But anyway, I just thought I'd review the case file since I keep forgetting to do that. Uh, I think I lost it somewhere in here. Here you go. The case summary for the Barber of Seville. Barto coerced Rose into a relationship with her abusive husband, Laurent. Confirmed this, grabbed the properties, and went to murder Barto. Rose sent a note to her brother, Ficaron, telling him of the situation. Protective of his sister, Ficaron sent her a note telling her not to worry. He disguised himself using the stage costume for the poor student and went to the love nest Barto kept in the cafe for his assignations. Laurent had already slashed Barto's throat when Ficaron arrived. Ficaron used the same blade to kill Laurent. And now here's the part that I really liked. Pascal did not like Barto, but there is no evidence to link him to the crime. Which, I guess I was overthinking it before. Ugh. So, yeah. The one thing I didn't know is that she had sent a message to her brother, and I don't know if I'm just not remembering it, if I missed it, or if the game just doesn't tell you. Uh, hot chocolate to die for. Valerie de Close was poisoned by her younger sister who wanted to inherit their ancestors' fortune and gain independence. The crime revolved around an old legacy created by Margaret Monvoisson, whose fortune, likely earned through the use and sale of exotic poisons, is passed down to the eldest surviving female of that line. Valerie, as the eldest, had inherited the fortune, but her husband, whose death also raises questions, wrote a conflicting will. It was this will that put the money out of Valerie's hands, declaring family friend George Villiers... Sigonzac as executor and her son Pierre Duclos as sole trustee. She received a lawyer's assurances that the entire fortune uh, did in fact belong to her, but with the qualification that as long as George Villier was active, uh, she would not enjoy control of it. It's for this reason that Valerie was especially angry on this night, and also this reason that the notion of denouncing George to the Committee of Public Safety, thereby removing him from the equation, came to her head. However, her younger sister, Amelie, without an income of her own and dependent on, upon her relations, realized that if Valerie died, the money would come to her as the next female in the line. Using a recipe inherited by Valerie, Amelie cocked a powerful poison which she stored in a poison ring, also inherited. This particular evening, the victim threatened to denounce George. Uh, Amelie saw the incredible opportunity of removing her sister while leaving the hapless George as the obvious culprit. She secretly poisoned Valerie's cocoa and then gave the cup to George and discarded her ring in the garden. Well, obviously she didn't do a very good job because she could have just thrown it in a river and we would have never found it. But that was that. I'm not going to read Ancestral Vengeance. That was so long ago. Alright, so I think before I do... Uh, see, actually, I, I'm thinking I'm just going to turbo through this. I want to turbo through this uh, because I like even this chest right here requires level three, and I don't have level three. So I'm just gonna play the for this next sequence, and then I guess that'll be all I'll do for today, and then I'll just do side missions. And let me go empty out the bank. Sleep well, sir. That way I can up my income. Celestine, thank God. Are you all right? Ah, full purse again. Of course, monsieur. Why wouldn't I be? He sounds a little bit like Shay. A little bit. I know that their accents are obviously very different, but he sounds a little bit like Shay. If you take out the Irish accent. Oops, I drew my weapon. Oh, come on. Look how much it'd take just to replenish this. Let me guess, the stun grenades are actually not that expensive. It's the phantom blades. They cost way too much. Cherry bombs are nothing.
Do I even have this ability? Oh, yeah, I do. It's an achievement to drop 20 of them. I'm going to try to get that, or a trophy. I'll do that later, I suppose. Medicine. Oh, medicine's expensive. I have to buy it, though. Alright, and I'll leave the Phantom Blades, because I don't have enough to replenish that. Did I buy lockpicks? Yeah, I have lockpicks. Okay. Gotta buy a new sword next. That's that's one of the things I have to do. The King's Correspondence. The King is in possession of certain letters that might incriminate the assassins. Find and destroy them before the mob gets a hold of them. Oh, my finger is so killing me. summoned monsieur dorian we have a task for you more fetch and carry work i imagine two master assassins are dead one by your own hand in defense of a templar count yourself lucky this is the extent of your punishment and germain is none of your concern <laughs> last night the paris commune declared itself an open insurrection against the king as we speak twenty thousand armed revolutionaries are laying siege to the tuileries even the national guard are on the brink some of them have thrown in with the revolutionaries. France is splitting at the seams. And this doesn't please us. The people are fighting for what is owed them. Liberté. Égalité. If we danced about on a simple scale in need of balancing, you'd be right. But the truth is more complicated. In putting Mirabeau's affairs in order, we've come across certain correspondences of a royal nature. Mirabeau's in contact with the king. And he was rather less discreet than he should have been. If the King's copies of these letters were made public, the Templars would be in a position to expose and purge our agents across France. Oh, thanks, Mirabeau. Time to slip in and find them first. And quickly. The Swiss Guard are badly outnumbered. It's likely they'll be overwhelmed before nightfall. All right, let's do the it. first palace I've broken into. The other guy didn't say anything. He was just walking around. Okay. Actually, I was just there. That's where the murder mystery is behind that door I can't unlock yet. Alright, so let's do that. Then we'll get to the, the final Sequence 9. I might have to do an extra couple of missions in Sequence 9 to get all the points I'll need uh, to unlock the final lockpicking level, but then I'll be good. Then there will be no more secrets. Ready? Aim! Shit, man. Damn, they executed them. Look at this place. Honest quality of rhetoric amongst bloodthirsty rioters these days. I'm trying to see how I'm going to do cover kills. I don't know how to do them in this game since you can't whistle. That was weird. You saw that? He had the fire in him. Yeah. I don't think there's any way I can kill these two. Nope. I am screwed.
Oh, I thought they broke up. There's just two more guards. I don't know, Cherry Bomb maybe? Oh shit, everyone's coming over here to investigate that. Where did he something's not right? Where are you? Huh. You bleeding pellet. Alright, they didn't come over. Especially the two guys right there didn't even care. What the? Okay, he saw me from behind. He wasn't even looking right at me. Well, I'm out of here. Yeah, I have to be anonymous to sabotage that shit. Fuck that. Holy shit, that's a lot of people. Jesus Christ. I can't see. First of all, they broke combat. Now I'm fucked. <laughs> this is where the fun begins. Fuck, I was gonna try and slip away. That's not at all what I wanted to do. Yeah, there's no way I can fight all these guys legitimately. We're still ringing the alarm bell! Oh my god, yeah, I knew I wasn't going to be able to counter shit tonight. I can't reach him! Fucking up. They're just gonna keep bringing that bell. I don't know if they'll bring anyone out. You really miss that? I can't see at all. Oh shit, I got the assassinate on him. And they pumped me full of lead. Weird shit is going on. Oh shit. Fucking hell. Someone dropped a flashbang, but I dropped smoke. Fucking kill the big guys. What is he gonna drop a smoke bomb or something? That guy didn't even swing for me, and he got a hit on me. That doesn't stun me. Nope, I can still see it. That I couldn't see. It's 
right from nowhere. Didn't do anything. What? Now he's glitched. <laughs> Where is he? Some one guy taking shots with a pistol and ringing the bell as soon as he can. He ducked it. He fucking ducked it. Ah, I combo that. I countered that too early. He's dead. All right, you're next. Fucking I. This guy is MLG. I can't get the shoulder tackle on him. That's what I need to do for him. Level 5 asshole. Unfortunately, this is where the hidden blades will be really good. Because it will be really quick, constant attacks. And you could kill someone fairly quickly. But that's not a, that's not a viable option. I got two medicine from him. And he disappeared! Jesus. Alright, I'm good. I have eight medicine now, okay. Well, this is pointless. What? Hold a moment, citizen. Got ya. Those who oppose us. All right. Hey, show yourself. Got ya. Yeah, I can't assassinate him. man here we go this is probably how you get some cover kills He's too far. Oh, no, he isn't. He's perfect. He's perfect. I can get him. Hey, get up. Oh. I'm going to wait for this guy, the big guy, to go right back down the hallway. Oh, God. Go on. Then I have to find a few more alarm bells. If I can get my three cover kills here... And I'm just not going to care, and I'm just going to run around fighting people until I can sabotage two more alarm bells. I just don't know where said alarm bell... Well, I see another one. I don't know where the third one will be. That was bullshit. Should have never grabbed him like that. That made no sense. This game still has problems with, like, clipping, with hitboxes, animations freezing up. 
Alright, wait for this guy to come right back. Here he comes. This guy is determined to pick this door, no matter what. Get over here. Whoop, you're a big boy. All right, enough of this. Stop. Jesus, you're not getting it open. I wish I could round this corner. Here you go. Got him. I love how it does the image of him <laughs> killing him. That's great. All right. There is a shield somewhere around here. Oh, this is where the murder mystery takes place. It's right here, but it's it's not displaying it because there's a mission right now. All right, and the last two alarm bells are out here. Let me see if I can slip out, cut them, and I'm looking at the ceiling, and then just slip right back in so I don't have to fight, like, 50 guys at once. Oh, I found the king's office. See if I can get the double air assassination. Wait for him to walk. Okay. It's not how they usually look, but it was a double air assassination. All right, now these ones are just given. There's more than enough cover kills. Way more than enough. There's like four or five you can do. Gotcha. Fuck that shit. Alright, at least you can cancel moves in this game. I'm not used to games letting you do that. Yeah, keep your fucking eyes open. And now you're dead. You 
can see me. Okay, then. Nice cover. I'm gonna have to surprise this guy. Got him. He had his sword in his hand. That was cool. Hop. Got them hops. All right, we're done. You're an idiot, aren't you? 